It's time for a Ferrari safari on steroids because in this wind, it feels like I'm going four times faster than I normally do. Girls, we'll be back with you in a second. Don't go anywhere. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Nicholas, uh, our ranger, thinks I'm very funny. He's laughing at me and giving me the thumbs up. Uh, I'm not sure, sorry, because there's so much when I can't really hear what Kirsten's saying. So if you're going to go away from me, I'll see you shortly, hopefully at Dusty Crossing. Some of them have already made it across. Fast, Vildes, fast. Ah, they are very fast, Vildes. They've already made it across, and I'm getting there as fast as possible. But I know you're watching the incredible river cams. Uh, this is quite exciting. I think this is the first time we've ever actually been at a crossing with the vehicle while the river cam is there as well. And of course, it's that magical time of the day where we become the only car in the Mara. Everyone else is heading for home and we are not going anywhere. Oh, crocodile's got a full beast. I'm trying to get there. Hold on, guys. We're on our way. <coughs> oh, I swallowed a fly. <coughs> <laughs> a baby wildebeest apparently Kirsten's telling me we're nearly there hold on uh, one last big bump don't fall off Dave apparently the wildebeest is still trying to escape we're gonna be there in a matter of seconds two crocodiles now apparently on it there are still some other wildebeest approaching from the other bank that you won't be able to see okay Dave, can you... Oh, there we go. Okay, well, well, we're here. Bouncy, bouncy, lots of rocks. There's a third crocodile actually coming in. There we go. We've just got here. I think we're a little late, unfortunately. And we weren't even that far away. Wasn't a big crossing. Not too many animals. And now three crocodiles descended on that poor baby wildebeest. There we go. What's that? Is that a rock? That is a rock. There we go. Mid midstream, midstream. Oh, shame. Poor little one. That is not a little one, though. That is the crocodile's tail. That's where it went down. Now, you might see gusting dust come through us, and that's from the wildebeest that made it across, that are running behind us at the moment. Look downstream, Dev. There we go. Now, that doesn't look like a young wildebeest at all, though. From the horns, that looks like a big wildebeest. Now, not to say that more than one might have been taken. Uh, it's a thing. It's, I think these crossings are so chaotic. Where are my binoculars now? Binos, binos. Now, the funny thing about these wonderful... Oh, there's another crocodile coming in to where the others are. Spending all this time out here. Oh, there we go. Just checking the two girls are still in the same spot they are. Um, is that we do tend to have an, ex an ordinary amount of warmth or warm clothing and blankets that we carry with us because it can get very chilly. So sometimes my binoculars disappear into said uh, <laughs> abyss of uh, blankets, shookers, jerseys and jackets. Hi, Hunter. Uh, Hunter's wondering when will the migration end? Now, Hunter, that is a very good question because we're not exactly sure. It changes from year to year uh, depending on rainfall, depending on availability of grass. So it all very much depends. So I think this year it might stay in Kenya a little bit longer. Oh dear. Well, the crossing's over and I can just see what looks to be the cheetah girls on the move. You see them there, Dave? It's all happening here, live in Kenya, to the right a little bit. 
So the river cam is watching us. Wave, Dave. Wave, Nicholas. There's a camera there. Say hi, Nick. So Nick is our ranger. He's awesome. He's been with us for the last couple of days. And um, we are having the best time ever. So we're going to go now follow those girls because they are heading towards a really big herd of wildebeest. If you go to the right a little bit, Dave, on top of the ridge. There we go, and there's a lot more over the edge. So it's time to get on my Ferrari safari again. Uh, we definitely don't want to lose those girls, especially at this time of this day when it is the best time for cheetah hunt hunting. And as you can see, the wind's everywhere. Uh, so while I try to reorganize myself, let's go back to Taylor.